They stand 400 feet tall with 300 foot wingspans. Their blades reach speeds of 150 miles per hour. We live in a powered world and getting away from fossil fuels is the right thing to do for the planet. But even green energy has hidden costs. Half a million birds are killed by these blades every year in the U.S. and twice as many bats are destroyed. This is a huge toll on already stressed wildlife. Woodland Park Zoo is looking for solutions. Zookeepers spend long days observing raptor behavior and their interactions with turbines here in the Northwest. Working with Washington Department of Fish and Wildlife, they're studying the risks these birds face living among wind turbines. They want to find out why birds with such excellent vision keep getting hit. Perhaps the birds are so focused when hunting that they don't anticipate these massive objects. Maybe there's a smarter way to choose new wind farm sites. Zookeepers are asking questions in their research. How do we limit bird strikes on existing wind farms? How often do hawks leave the nest to hunt in order to feed their chicks? How close do they fly to these large machines? Are there certain hours of the day that are the riskiest for raptor flight? If we can make wind farm sites safer for all birds and other animals, this renewable energy source becomes truly green. Find out more at zoo.org forward slash raptors.